hi and welcome to another youtube video so in today's video we are going to be talking about the concept of the line graph also known as a line plot or the line chart so basically i see the line chart as one of the simplest uh, data visualization tools it's just a line and few dots one of the main usefulness of the line chart is based on the fact that it is used to visualize how a variable changes over a period of time either monthly yearly daily or hourly take for example a business is trying to see how their profits changes over the year from january down to december if they want to visualize this then they have to use uh, the line chart so the line chart actually consists of the vertical axis and the horizontal axis uh, on the horizontal axis we actually have uh, the time either yearly uh, monthly or daily like probably january february march down to december or the years like let's say 2001 2002 down to wherever year and on the horizontal axis we actually have uh, the frequency uh, of the variable that we are working with so the dot actually uh, is the point that corresponds to the value we are actually working with and then we actually use a line to uh, to connect all the dots so a line chart is actually kind of similar to the bar chart some of the few differences based on the fact that unlike a bar chart in which the categorical variable is actually on the horizontal axis for a line chart we have uh, the time you know on the horizontal axis and also the bar chart makes use of bars while the line chart actually makes use of line but they are a bit similar to each other basically we actually have three types of line chart we have what we call the simple line chart and this is uh, the type of line chart that is most popular in which we are going to be uh, constructing uh, the line chart for uh, a single variable over a time period so let's say uh, we have profit profit is just a single variable and then we have let's say years or month so if you want to visualize this using a line chart then you're going to be using a simple line chart and the second type of line chart is what we call a multiple line chart and this is the line chart that we use whenever we want to like kind of uh, visualize two variables or two or more variables rather over a period of time so let's say we have profit and sales and we want to visualize profit and sales over uh, a year like let's say january down to december then a multiple line chart is actually going to be used uh, a compound line chart is like a combination of a single line chart and a multiple line chart in the sense that when we plot a compound line chart it can be used to um, it can basically tell us the total area under the graph and uh, we can use it to totalize uh, the variables that we are actually working with as usual i will go into excel and teach us how to use excel to actually plot a line chart and uh, i will start with a very simple data set the one that i actually uh you know built on my own and then we walk down to the popular superstar data set which is the larger data set so without further ado let's move into excel so here we are in excel we have the month which represents the time we have profit and we have quantity sold so profit is one of the variables and quantity is another variable so first thing i want to visualize uh the profit over the year over a year so that means uh I want to visualize the profit from January down to December. All I have to do is to just uh, select all of this. So that means I've selected the month and profit. I come to insert. And I come to the line chart. Then I click on this. I prefer the one that has both the dot and the line. So and that is it. I have actually visualized profit and month. I can also decide to visualize month uh, and quantity sold. As usual, I select month and quantity. Uh, I come to the line chart and then uh i click on this so i have something like this so i've actually visualized this i can either make this red or something so this is actually uh, a simple line chart if i want to uh, plot a multiple line chart all i have to do is to select everything we have here so right here i want to visualize profit quantity sold across january down to december so i come to insert i click right here and then boom here we are so this is uh actually uh the line chart for profit and quantity then we can just you know edit this and call it profit slash quantity so um if you want to convert this to uh, a compound line chart you can just come here and insert and then this area right here so this is a compound line chart something like this or you can use this or we can use this okay we can either use this we can use this uh we can use this we can use this. all of those are called compound line chart you know so let's now move into the uh the popular superstore data set and see if we can actually uh plot a line chart and this is our data set as usual the first step is to select all of this that's ctrl a and then we insert a pivot table so 
let's make a pivot table right here so i mentioned earlier that a line chart is actually best used with uh time with anything that has to do with time so that means uh things like year uh month or day should be actually be would actually be on the row so um let me try to say i want to visualize my data set based on month so and we have month one month two month three down to the month twelve, which represents uh january february march april you know down to december so let's say i want to visualize profit so i can just come here and drop profit right here so i want to visualize profit over the first 12 months so as usual i can select all of this uh pivot chart analysis you know um then come to the line chart and uh, i click on this i prefer to use this and boom and this is actually uh the total sum of profits being visualized using the line chart you know we can also decide to add uh one more variable so that we can be able to plot either the multiple line chart or the compound line chart so i can just decide to bring like sales right here all right so and as you can see immediately it has actually added another uh line chart on the line chart i actually plotted initially so i can also edit this and kind of make it um a compound excuse me i can also edit this and kind of make it a compound uh chart you know let's make it this we can choose this we can choose this uh, we just have to choose the one that suits us probably this so this is a compound line chart one of the most important properties of the line chart is based on the fact that the line chart is basically used to represent discrete or continuous variables that is uh, those variables that are actually numerical in nature if you need to learn about the scales of data sets that we have in statistics i have a video right here and if you need to see the video about the bar chart and the pie chart i have a video about this right here so you can just also check that out do you think i missed something or you have some questions for me please go down to the comment section and drop those questions i'll be willing to actually answer your question thanks for making it to the end of this video and we'll see you in the next one bye for now